Hi, I'm Brent Green, and welcome to another great episode of The Green Scene. Today's guest does beautiful things with fallen trees, so let's go check out some environmentally accurate furniture designs. So we're here with Heeman Hill, and he manufactures furniture from fallen trees. Heeman, can you tell us what it is that inspired you to use this medium for your art? Uh, just the fact that you're reclaiming all of this material and putting it to a good use as opposed to it getting chopped up into firewood and burnt in the atmosphere. And um, also, I can make somewhat of a you know, significant uh, artist statement with the amount of designs that I'm able to manufacture. Tell us about your process for choosing the, uh, the wood. Uh, well, there's a mill uh, my business partner and I have above Santa Barbara, and we have a contract with the state. They allocate all their downfall to our yard. So uh, most of the material is from winter or storm downfall, or uh, we also know construction companies, if they're going to do a development and they're going to take some trees out, we'll try to get them to send it to the yard so it won't be uh, lost, you know, chopped up in the firewood. Would this also be considered a form of reducing, reusing, and recycling? All reclaimed, uh, environmentally accurate, good energy. Okay, that, that sounds like excellent energy, excellent energy. So can you tell us a little bit about this piece? Uh, this nightstand is made of Clara walnut. It has a live edge here. It's all reclaimed from uh, wind or storm downfall in the winter. And it has a Monterey cypress base, which comes from these trees you see behind us. Your live edge line actually is, to me, probably the best. I, I like it the most out of all of the stuff that you've done. Yeah, that look is just really taking off in the industry. and. Um, uh, I can't get the stuff done quick enough. The galleries that carry the line of furniture are constantly ordering from me. And the Live Edge isn't the only line of furniture you have, right? No, the uh, two main lines uh, are French Country and Italian Country, and they're made of old West Coast barn wood, salvage, reclaimed material. Uh, the French Country has a water base, a paint finish on it, and the Italian Country has natural uh, cherry and walnut stains. So can you tell our viewers out there where they can find your beautiful furniture? Well, the line is represented uh, primarily on the West Coast. Uh, here in San Francisco, I'm carried at Planet Earth on Divisadero. And I'm also represented in New York and Miami Beach. Planet Earth, huh? Yeah, Planet Earth, the place to go and spend your money. And uh, it sounds like you're all over the world besides Planet Earth, too. Well, my biggest client at one time was uh, Sundance Catalog that Robert Redford owned, and he sold my sideboards left and right. They went all over the place. And I've heard that your furniture has also been on the uh, television screen. Yeah, I was in the first uh, two seasons of the Learning Channel show, Little People, Big World. If you watch uh, that show, you'll see inside of the Roloff's house my almars and tables and sideboards. All right, well, we got a very own star here on the green scene. So this wraps our shoot of Heeman Hill and his environmentally accurate furniture designs. You can Google him at HeemanHill.com. This episode has been our tribute to all those people out there fighting to make this country leaner and greener. This is Brent Green from the Green Scene on Bid SF.